homework. I'm going to do first. Annotate. Serena is trying to become a more environmental conscious by making her own cleaning products. She's researched different cleaners and decided to make furniture polishing using olive oil. So you should use olive oil and lemon juice. She wants to make two 24 ounce bottles. So two 24 ounce bottle that equals to 48 ounce altogether. Okay. She wants to make 48 ounce basically. Write an equation in standard form that relates to the amount of olive oil. Um, equation in standard form. So they want you to write an equation in standard form that relates to the amount of olive oil and lemon juice to, to the total amount of mixture. Okay, so total amount of mixture we know we want the total of 48 ounce. So total amount of mixture is 48 ounce. Okay. Serena wants to, to make. That X represents the amount of lemon juice. Oh, worse. Okay, that's X. And Y represents the amount of oil. Y. Oh, okay. So we got X and Y. Y and X has to equal to 48. Hmm, look at that. See? I need you to find the variable, though. X equals to amount of orange juice. You need to get used to writing the, um, what each, defining the variable. Because most of you are not doing it. I need to take more points off when you don't on the test equals to an amount oh, amount of um, lemon juice thinking about defining a variable amount of lemon juice okay and why is the olive oil the amount of olive oil. Okay. Okay, write an equation. So it's x plus y equals to 48 ounce. So the amount of olive oil plus the amount of orange juice has to equal, I mean lemon juice has to equal to 48 ounce altogether. Okay. The recommendation of mixture is, oh, the recommended mixture is the amount of olive oil must be twice, okay, amount of olive oil, that's Y, must be twice, and that's two, the amount, two times, um, two times the lemon juice, X. So olive oil has to equal to two times the amount of X of lemon juice. We wrote this equation before. Write an equation in terms of X and Y. Define in part A that represents the situation. Okay. We know that olive oil, Y is amount of olive oil, is going to equal to two times the amount of lemon juice. Use substitution to solve the equation in part A and B. Show your work. Okay, that's easy enough. Use that. Substitute it into this Y here. This is no longer there. X plus 2X equals to 48. So our equation basically is X plus Y equals to 48 and um, Y equals to 2X from right there. Okay. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna I don't like all this mess here. I hate seeing that. So I'll, I'll rewrite them both here. And we cross that out, put these two in there. That's what we did. 
So we got 3x equals to 48 divided by 3. We get 16. x equals to 16. Now that 16 means the 16 is the um, 16 ounces of the amount of all of uh, of lemon juice. This is the amount of lemon juice. So, 16 ounces of the lemon juice. X represents the amount of lemon juice. 16 what ounces? Because they're talking about ounces up here. Ounce of lemon juice. Okay. Um, So how many um, olive oil? To find olive oil, we're going to use this y equals 2x. So x is 16 times 16, then y in, then is 32 ounces of olive oil. So together, notice if we add these two together, if we add um, x plus y all of, um, equals to 48 because you get 16 plus 32 we get 48 ounces 16 ounce of le lemon juice plus 32 ounce of olive oil makes 48 ounce so she mix them all together divide them two bottles works perfect um, Oh, see, look at this. What does the solution? The solution is 16 and 32, right? What does the solution in part C represents? Represents. The answer represents. Sixteen ounces. of lemon juice combine with combine with 32 ounces of um, olive oil Okay, I'm going to post this page and then we'll do the second part. Alright, so it won't be too long on the internet. Um, anyways, this is the answer.